What's going on everybody, yours truly here and today we're going to be playing NBA 2K8 10 years later. Yeah, NBA 2K8, not 18. If you're thinking 18, then take away that one and we got NBA 2K8. I did NBA 2K9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Now we're going back in time even more, so let's get into it. Now NBA 2K8, I never had this on the Xbox 360. When I got this game for the very first time, I actually got it for the PS2. So this is going to be my first time playing it on the Xbox 360. You know I'm going to have to get used to the controls and you already know. In order to get used to the controls, we got to play a game. One thing 2K always gets down right is the presentation. The presentation for the games is always just great. So if y'all know the game College Hoops 2K8, this game plays very similar to that. They even got Kenny the Jet Smith commentating. That's crazy. Kenny always been with 2K. Look at Doc Rivers. Now as we get further into this video, just one thing that I want to say is I don't know exactly how much there is to do in this game, but I'm going to try and do as much as possible because we all know that on the older 2Ks, it wasn't that much to do. Bam. All right, let's give it to Kobe. Oh yeah, that's a touchdown. No, he didn't. Kobe Bean Bryant taking it way back. In 2K now, that would have been a block. But I think the fact that Kobe Bryant is Kobe Bryant, that's why it didn't happen. And that should have been a steal. That's a block for sure. All right, Kobe, show us that range. Show us that range. All right, that's going to do it. Let, let's get into something else. So we got the game modes here. I mean, typical old 2K generic. You got your generic game modes. Not really that much to do you got the association season playoffs rookie challenge and we did all this in nba 2k9 but i mean this is nba 2k8 it's a different game different gameplay and we're gonna explore that that's exactly what we're gonna do so what i didn't do in nba 2k9 was a three-point shootout so i'm gonna go ahead and pick these players and i'll be right back all right so we got our players right here ryan scalabrini shaquille o'neal kwame brown and dwight howard I think this might be the best three-point contest of all time. All right, Brian Scalabrini is up, a.k.a. the GOAT. All right, I think I made a mistake picking the GOAT because he might just win this. I like the area, though, surrounding this three-point contest. You got a court, and then you got some stores surrounding it, and people actually watching. Oh, my goodness. Look at Shaq. This is horrible. Would you look at that? Even 2K back then had a shot meter. Look. Here we go. Here we go. There it is. Come on, Shaq. Come on, Shaq. Random acts of Shaqness. There it is. There it is. Ah. Six points. I mean, I don't think nobody else is going to beat that, so. Just miss that for I love it. I love it. See, that's why I chose Shaq. The big Aristotle. Oh, yeah, there it is. That's what we like to see. Victory is in sight. All right, here go Dwight Howard, a.k.a. Superman. Dwight's actually been playing pretty good this year for the for the Hornets. I mean, he, he's putting up all-star stats, and he's looking like the old Dwight Howard. I don't even know if we get another round. I think this might be it. We came in second place. There you have it. There's the winner, Brian Scalabrini. All right, that was actually pretty cool. So let's see what else NBA 2K8 has to offer in terms of blacktop pickup game dunk contest. This is what 2K needs to bring back now, celebrities. I don't know why 2K puts in cool features and it ends up taking them out. It doesn't make sense to me. How I thought games work, especially when they come out every year, is you build off of what you had the previous year. Wow, he even wearing a hat. Ugh, but look at that jump shot. I always thought as a video game that comes out every year, you're supposed to build off of what you already have. 2K, they don't do that. They'll put in a dope feature and take it out the next year. Then the year after that, they'll bring back that feature and then take out even more features i never understood that like is it because it's just not enough space on the game and i'm always poking the ball i'm always poking the ball loose from steve nash but i never end up with it comment is too slow i'm reaching oh i finally ended up with the ball and what does common do dribble between the legs but it's all right we got that three finally i didn't think he was gonna get one to go down now i could sleep at night knowing common could hit wide open threes okay common get up there raise the roof on him I know you. Okay, Common. He proving me wrong now. He proving me wrong. All right, we down by three. Foul and one. Let's get it. Common came to play. He started off a little cold, but he's starting to pick it up now. Chris Bosh, he needs to step it up. This ain't the prehistoric days. This is 2008. Let's pick it up. This is 2008, back where you can glitch through bodies to get a dunk off. It's starting to get a lot easier now. 
Starting to get a lot easier now. Starting to get a lot more difficult now. I'm relying on Common, but they forgot about Chris Bosh. Let's get it. I know Steve Nash could shoot, but I want him to shoot. I want him to shoot because he looking to pass. Here we go. Come on, Chris. Show me something. Talk to me, Chris. I want Steve Nash to shoot it. I'm here. I'm helping. It ain't no three in the key. Look, that's what happened when you show off. That's why we're just here to play. We're not here to show off. Chris don't help my team in any way, shape, or form. Chris Bosch wants us to lose because he's not getting enough shine. Because Common can rap, dance, and hoop. And all Chris Bosch got is his eggs that he left. Ooh, sliding on that concrete. I know that hurt. You all right, Mello? All right. Apparently, Chris Bosch can't shoot threes. So it's up to Common to save the day. Common is doing everything he can right now. Chris, pick up the slack. All right, here we go. It's all good. Common, saving the day, taking the lead on him. Let's get it, Common. No threes, got my hands up. I'll take that. I'm gonna shoot the three. This is for the game. Fuck you! <laughs> Just hype me up for nothing. I'm gonna end up with it. That's game. That's game, ladies and gentlemen. That's how we do it. Since there's only so much you can do on the older 2Ks, I feel like this might be the very last thing we do and what i'm gonna do here is do a playoff game mode i'm gonna look at the way the season standings are in the 2017 2018 season i'm gonna set up the playoff trees according to the standings in the nba now so i got the brackets to how they set up in real life so we got raptors at number one and the best players on the Raptors at this time was Chris Bosh, I believe. LeBron still in the Cavaliers. The Celtics might do some damage in this playoff bracket. Bottom line is going to be interesting. So let's see what happens. All right, so after the end of the first round, we got the Supersonics beat the Spurs in five. The Jazz and the T-Wolves. Okay. With the Raptors and Bucks, I hope that's not how it's going to be in real life. A lot of people know the Toronto Raptors. You know, a lot of people know them as choke artists during the playoffs. So I think the Raptors will be able to get through the Bucks, but this game says otherwise these are the two teams that got past their opponents jazz beat the t-wolves sonics beat the hornets the fifth and sixth seed in the western conference finals you don't see that often and the bucks and celtics second seed versus the eighth seed i knew the celtics would get pretty far they got rondo ray allen paul pierce and kg this is looking like march madness right now a lot of upsets the Celtics versus the Jazz. And if the Jazz is the sixth seed and Celtics is second, I think we know who won this. Okay, that, whoa, that caught me <laughs> by storm. And look at Carlos Boozer. They had Carlos Boozer and Darren Williams. Probably some more players too, but those are like the key stars that I remember from this team. What if the Utah Jazz somehow wins the NBA Finals? this year of course that's that's probably not gonna happen that's gonna do it for this video i hope you enjoy and today we played nba 2k8 10 years later and this game was a lot of fun definitely a lot of fun to go back and play but other than that my name is yours truly if you enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like because it really motivates me to keep doing what i'm doing if you didn't enjoy the video then leave a comment on how i can make it more enjoyable for others and if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe because just like liking the video it really motivates me to keep doing what i'm doing and if you don't do this already follow me on twitter because it's just like subscribing to my YouTube channel, but not only will you be on top of the game, but you'll be ahead of it as well. So why not follow me on Twitter? Link will be in the description. Other than that, I'm yours truly. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bitch, sit down. Nobody with me.